Hello, this is clip two. I keep having warfare. I have never had so much warfare. This is my phone that I'm recording off. Can't record off any of my other things because it just stops. And my phone is stopping all of a sudden. I used to could record 14, 15, 20 minute videos. Y'all know that. And all of a sudden it stops me. So I know that you know the enemy. So let me finish. This is clip two. So in Frank E. Peretti's book he talks about spiritual warfare cities states nations regions what happened is whoever prays the most wins that region or has the most power in that region so what's happening is there are more demonic prayers going up than the prayers of the saints in this hour and that's why you have the dimensional shift so god is saying thus said the lord he's saying y'all have to come up we have to start praying more Come on, somebody, not that entertainment spirit. Just want to get people to, oh, she tore it up or he tore it up or they sound good. Ain't nobody caring about that in this hour because souls are needing to be saved. People are need to be breaking the bondages off of them. Spiritually, mentally, people are getting killed by these demons. This stuff not no game. Come on, somebody. So it's time to go back to the threshing floor. It's time to go back to God, but only the pure saints can do it. But some of you are so tainted, God says. You're attaining wanting more money. You're attaining, you're running after all this stuff. Do you not understand the signs of the times? It's almost over with. And the enemy knows this, and yet Christians don't know that. Y'all still trying to do this, do this, do this, do this, do this. You have one mission left, and that is to try to snatch back every soul that you can from the demonic kingdom. Hallelujah in this name. I'm telling you the truth before God. It is time to get back, you guys. It is time for consecration. Hallelujah. It is time for purity. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. It is time to be purified with his sip. It's too much, too much foolishness going on in the body of Christ to where we don't have no pure prayers. You heard me. It's called pure prayers of the saints. Prayers of the righteous are valid much, God says in this word. Come on, somebody. That's why the enemy don't want unity. That's why he's creating all this stuff, even this race wars. He knows that divided, we can conquer nothing. Come on, somebody. That's why he has come right in the church, sitting up dead up in the church, preaching dead in the church. Come on, somebody. The enemy knows the Bible more better than some of you. Come on, somebody. I didn't mean to say more better, but better. He knows it. He knows that word in and out. He knows that the vision. And, and, and then another thing, some of y'all trying to cast out demons in y'all church. How can Satan going to cast out Satan? You heard me. It's time to return back to the oracles of God, God says. And if y'all get a chance, please read that book by Frankie Peretti. It's called Piercing Through the Darkness. That's what we have to do. Because that's been a paradigm shift. And the enemy thinks that he's winning. He knows he has but a short time because this is it. So he's trying to take everybody he can with him. And they're doing a good job, by the way. Which I rebuke in the name of Jesus. So it is time for us. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. So it is time for us to take our positions as warriors in the kingdom of God. Start lifting up prayers. Start fasting more. Move them place. Come on, somebody. Move them place. Quit, quit thinking that this is just about a show. Hallelujah to his name. We got to do better. God said we got to be better.